Right, well, you know we went out for dinner Friday night. Yeah. Well, lovely Italian. He paid for everything. Very mm -hmm. nice. Um, and he kept asking me to go back to his place. He's been bragging about what amazing house he's got. Mm. So anyway, eventually I agreed to go back for a nightcap. And he's right, it is beautiful. He showed me around. It's lovely. So anyway, we're falling around on the sofa. Mm. And suddenly hear key go in the lock. So he jumps up and asks me to hide. So I kick off and start shouting at him. In walks his mother. But turns out it's her house and he's living with her. Oh, Lying git. <laughs> You're gonna see him again. Not so John, it's me. I got it. I got the job. I know. Okay. Okay, talk to you later. Love you too. Yes. He is nice to us though, isn't he? Yeah, for a fat bastard who fucks around on his wife. Sure, he's the kind of guy I could live with. Well, what else do you expect from a man? If I had a husband, I'd expect him to fuck around. Well, you wouldn't be bothered if he went with all the tarts he could get. What you don't know can't hurt you. I bet our mum's having a bit on the sly. It's not quite the same thing, though. Dad's long gone. How do you know? Because I got out of bed to go to the toilet and I heard her bed squeaking. <sighs> well, she might have been moving about. Are you kidding? With the amount of grunting coming from that bedroom, she was moving all right, but not in her sleep. Well, I'm waiting. I'm sorry. I just couldn't get it. I tried. <laughs> I told you what would happen if you didn't come through. I know. I'm sorry. I just need more time. Time's just run out. Mate, please. I'll fix it. Just one more day. Twelve hours. Next time we won't be walking away. Oh, my head. It hurts. What happened? You had a nasty knock to it. Don't worry about that now. I'm here to mother you back to hell. And that was it. He'd gone forever. I just couldn't go back. Yeah, sure, my life would have colour again, but it would be artificial colour. When you're floating on cloud nine, you run the risk of falling hard. And it really hurt me. I was happy to stay colourless, but with my feet firmly planted on the ground, for now. 